Damn, bro, they gave him a hammer, bro. If you telling me he not solo in the verse, I don't care because let's be honest, bro. Cinema man let speaker man jump up behind him and stab him in the face with a knife, bro. Speaker, I mean, I mean, camera man Titan is not going for that. We not, bro. It's too late. We lost a brother to the madness. So, you know, usually I don't really look at statistics too much on YouTube. I just kind of be recording videos and I just go. That's really how I've been since I started. So I was like, you know, I've been watching a lot of people do the little, oh, I have this many percentage of subscribers. So I got curious. I said, how many people that watch my videos are actually subscribed? And what do y'all think it is? Y'all want to guess? What do you think it's? It's 20%, it's 30%, 40%? No. Only 9% of y'all are subscribed. Y'all must not like me, man. I should just retire, bro. I should be done. Never do a reaction again, bro. Never do no more content. We do not care. I know you watching right there. You're guilty. You're guilty. I know you're not subscribed. You're not. Bro, just subscribe, bro. Listen, I'm almost at 100K, bro. At least subscribe right now and I touch 100K, and then after that, stay subscribed because you're still watching the videos anyway. What's wrong with y'all? And also, 30% females watch my videos also, which I thought was interesting because who in the world is watching me? I'm not going to lie. Y'all need to cut it out, bro. Try, I don't... <clears throat> All right, chill out, chill out, chill out. So today, we're back with another Moby reaction. I told y'all I wanted to wait till Moby did his analysis for the deep intellectual... And, and 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 super analytical version of, of of the episode because i seen it but i was tired and also i was just kind of like i probably missed some stuff that moby gonna pick up on so today we're gonna watch moby analyze the full episode it's gonna be kind of a chill reaction because i really just woke up even though it's like 6 p.m uh and yeah let's get it hello everyone hey my babe. on the moby channel What's i'm up? glad to see you on my channel again hey today the long-awaited 50 episode of skibbity toilet finally came out i know it was great this is the longest episode of all that is at the moment is it and really apparently that's why the author took longer than usual i didn't even know that this was the longest episode i mean i knew it was long but i didn't know it was that long pause to prepare this episode and in this video i will analyze the 50 episode of skibbity toilet we will discuss with you the long-awaited return of the updated Titan cameraman. Yeah. Show you hidden my guy. details that you might. Look at the go. Look at the go. I don't, bro. They gave him a hammer, bro. If you telling me he not solo in the verse, I don't care because, let's be honest, bro. Cinema man let speaker man jump up behind him and stab him in the face with a knife, bro. Speaker, I mean, I mean, cameraman Titan is not going for that. We not, bro. Might not have noticed, discuss future episodes and what might happen in them, and also talk about why there is no TV mans in this episode. Therefore, right nah, Moby, watch my reaction. <laughs> Moby, watch my reaction. There's no way. That's the first thing I said. I said, Yo, listen, how in the world is it that there is no TV men during this invasion? Hey, bro, I, you know, I don't mean to be this influential. I guess I just am, bro. Come on, Moby. You got. Come on. I know you watched it. You watched the reaction. Cause that's the first question I, I asked in my video. That and I said that. I said there's no TV men in there. And he said we gonna analyze that why there is no TV men. That's just for me, Moby. I love you too, bro. Thank you. Imagine he comes in my comment section, egos me, and says this is not for you, buddy. Who are you? <laughs> right now, put a like on this video. Let's get twenty thousand likes and be sure to subscribe to the channel. We already have. More Bro, I was subscribed on my other channel. I'm subscribed on like three channels with this guy, bro. Chill out. Don't don't call me a fake supporter. I'm supporting. Okay, I like I've liked more Moby videos than any of y'all. I know that's a fact. More than one hundred thousand subscribers, and we are confidently and quickly moving towards the goal of one hundred and twenty thousand subscribers. Nice. We are starting. The episode begins in the same place where the forty ninth episode ended specifically in the secret laboratory of the cameraman and from the very first frames we can notice that some kind of fuss i want to know who's ratting on 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 the cameraman like who told them the location imagine the tv people switched up that would be wild is going on among the agents in the background you can hear the alarm sound which means something has happened also on this frame you can notice that there are cameramen who have come under attack by skibbity toilets this can be understood by the fact that cameramen who look very tired are shown right in front of us. And also on the left you can see a cameraman who shows his colleague a new invention. And on the right agent speaker man tells something terrible to agent cameraman. By the way, 
on the cameraman you can see some new equipment similar to a bull how does he know all this though how, how is he deciphering their conversations okay sure i'll give him that on the left side it's new technology but how do you know he's telling him something is it because he looks distressed i mean i suppose i mean i'm not okay new equipment similar to a bulletproof vest then the operator runs out of the bunker and we immediately see the cameraman's car with a laser which we last yep, saw in episode in 38 the operator goes on and we see a very scary picture specifically that skibbity toilets have found a secret cameraman base and are attacking it in their full combat readiness as can be seen from these frames cameramen are trying their best to survive and save their allies also here you can notice a large speaker man agent and apparently there are very few of them left then the operator comes close there are only very few speaker men why though and what would make him say that sir and in these places we can see two silhouettes and these are not secret characters but watching cameraman agents right there on the right we can see another cameraman car the cameraman yeah i know a lot of people were saying uh before that these silhouettes were the pc people y'all need to cut it out all right y'all need to cut that out all right those are regular those are regular characters bro goes on and we see how the scientist cameraman gestures to us that it is better not to go any further yeah right. and the camera approaches i'm ten so just like assassin cameraman, cameraman goes to the crowd of huge skibbity toilets we know him well from episode 48 and right they want to make that's like the biggest i'm him moment ever imagine like he walked up and just got one tap i'm glad that they didn't let him go out like that he still retained all his coolness apparently he is not afraid of them he is ready to devour himself for the sake of his friend's cameraman. W. Right there we see a completely new mutant Skibbity whose eyes are closed with a very armored metal plate. Then he shows us his ability. He is like some kind of dragon throwing out a huge waterfall of fire from his mouth. And unfortunately some cameraman could not escape. Then the camera turns to the Skibbity toilet, which, as I understand it, destroys the observation towers with its sharp blades by the way right. we could see such blades from the mutant from episode 46 true then we are shown an attack of flying toilets on the cameraman base one of them we saw in the last 49 episode then the camera turns around and we see an updated huge laser cannon of cameraman you can see a tv on it so perhaps this invention Ooh. was developed by cameraman together with agents of tv man nice okay i ain't see that word shout out tv people i'm over here hating on them listen at the end of the day bro because i don't know where ski bd is gonna go like i don't know where this series is gonna lead us to but i almost imagine you're gonna have to pick a side and i'm team cameraman all the way to this day yo you know how long i've been rooting for cameraman bro i've always been team cameraman bro even when they introduce speakers tv people i never switched up all y'all was so happy over cinema man tv man y'all were so hype y'all were ready to jump ship nobody talks about camera people no more i always make sure i pay homage to the goat titan cameraman all the time every episode i always say we waiting for the comeback of the goat because we are but y'all was so quick to switch up everybody was everybody was talking about the tv this cinema man this y'all better stay with the tv people and tv woman of thought too i don't care about her no more i'm all i'm off the tea bro i'm giving everything up for tv cameraman i mean i mean uh titan cameraman Look, y'all trying to get me to wabbity wabbity, like, just mess up my words. Come on now, what are you doing? Next, the laser shoots and knocks down one flying mercenary toilet, but another one arrives after him and destroys this invention with a rocket. Then the camera turns and we see how the ninja cameraman goes without fear to the new fire-breathing skibbity toilet. In the same frame we see skibbity spiders. And this skibbity toilet has a scar on the eye similar on the Witcher's scar. Also <clears throat> here we see an improved version of the skibbity spider. He has become much taller and he has two laser guns. Word. Next, the camera turns and we finally see the long-awaited improved Titan cameraman. And I want the to tell you that he looks very, very cool. The he lands spectacularly and immediately destroys several skibbity the toilets. Goats. The updated skibbity the spider goats. immediately attacks the Titan with its lasers but he has a new updated armor, so he doesn't even feel his attack and in response, he shows us his new weapon, he shoots a spider from his cannon, it explodes and then he destroys all the skibbity toilets he sees on his way. Meanwhile, a large- A lot of people were telling me that the, these were, uh, it was a cannon and there's a magnet mode on it too, which makes sense. Toilet is trying to sneak up on him, but the Titan, thanks to his reaction, 
quickly turns around and demolishes the toilet with his huge jet hammer, breaking the enemy into small pieces. He then stored. a new fire-breathing skibbity toilet appears from the smoke and brings down a column of fire on the Titan cameraman and the Titan shows with all his appearance that he did not feel any damage and demonstrates his new ability to the mutant. A larger stream of blue fire that completely burns out the enemy. A similar scene we saw in the last 49 episode, when TV woman completely Indeed. burned the toilet with her radiation. Next, Indeed. the Titan cameraman is attacked by flying toilet mercenaries. One of them flies by and the Titan shows us another of his abilities, his second hand turns into a magnetic cannon that attracts the enemy and Slammed he easily breaks the toilet, from which he simply explodes and shatters into small fragments. Then the camera approaches and we can see in detail the updated Titan. As we can see, he took into account his past mistakes and his reactor was strengthened for him. Now it is similar to the one that the Titan TV man has, but only much stronger. Next, the Titan's magnetic cannon turns into a hand again and he shows us the legendary light. And I think this gesture up, has several meanings. One of them is naturally that by this action he shows that everything is fine. And also I think that the author asks you to like the video and really let's do it. Put this Yeah, everybody like the video right now, like the reaction right now, subscribe. If you're not subscribed, just, if you're already at this point in the video and you're not subscribed, it don't make sense. What are you hating? You a hater? Just, just subscribe, man. We, we on the road to 100k, bro. Like the episode. Let's make this episode the most popular on his channel. I think he will be very pleased. Then the Titan cameraman takes his jet hammer and flies away in an unknown direction on his new updated jetpack. I assume that he returns to the base again to get some treatment and rest after the battle. Then the camera turns and we see how the cameraman agents all like one, and it can be seen from them that they are very happy that the Titan cameraman has finally returned. Now they have hoped that they can win this war against Skibbity Toilets. This is the end of the episode and let me answer you the question I asked at the beginning, specifically, where are the TV man's agents in this episode? I assume that they are also at the main base of cameraman agents. I also think that the Titan TV man is also here and now all the forces of TV man's agents are going to what to fix and improve your leader. Also, let me tell you about what we can be shown in the next 17... So everybody's at that main base. Okay, so that's not the main base, it's a side base. So everybody's at the main base. But even then, that doesn't excuse, right? That don't excuse them not being there. Like, if they're under attack, they can teleport. Why are they not teleporting? Instead, we have the assassin cameraman going by himself. He doesn't know that he's going to receive help at all. Like, that's crazy. I don't know, man. It's still a little shady to me. Season. I assume that in one of the episodes, they will show us the Titan TV man. Perhaps they will show us how agents fix it. I assume that they will completely replace the screen and instead of the old plasma TV he will have some new updated model from which is it will be much stronger. Also in this episode, we were never shown a secret agent, so maybe he still works for Skibbity Toilets, or he works with a third party, on the side of people, but this is a topic for another video. The and side now of the we people, are moving on to imagine a and become humans versus cameramen in the end. Permanent section on my channel which is called Theories from Comments. Also, before we get to the Theories from Comments, how close do you think we are to the end of Skibidi Toilets? Do you think we're at the end? I remember somebody uh, asked if this was like the last episode, last episode and uh, apparently the fuck boom responded with, hell no, so maybe we have a lot more to go. We'll see, but y'all know we'll be here, so amen. Theory number one is that the Titan cameraman was renewed for a long time only because Skibidi Toilets progressed very quickly and invented new technologies. Perhaps it was so, Thanks for the theory, we move on to the next one, theory number two is that in future series, as I said, Titan TV man will appear, after all, after the Titan cameraman lost to the G toilet for the first time, a few episodes later we were shown how it was repaired, thank you Word. and we move on to the third theory, which is that, next season Titan cameraman will show us his new abilities, which we don't know about yet, also the author of this comment described in detail what updates Titan Cameraman received. Rocket Hammer, Laser Blaster, Core Flamethrower, Tractor Beam, Jetpack, Better Armor. Yeah. You can click on pause and read them. Theory number four is that in the following in the series we will see the Titan TV Man and the author of this comment claims that the updated Titan TV Man will turn out much better than the updated Titan Cameraman because the base Titan TV Man was stronger than the base Titan Cameraman, well, we will find out about this in the following episodes. 
Thanks for the theory and the final fifth theory is that there are very few speaker men, this may be due to the fact that the Titan speaker man has been on the enemy's side for a long time, well, I think in future episodes the Titan speaker man will be cured and he will stand on the good side again. At this point, this video comes to an end, if your theory did not get- Oh man, that's the end Hello of the video. Hello everyone. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed that right there. Nice little Moby reaction, nice little anal analysis. I feel like everything he said is pretty much what we covered, but it was a few things that were new. Uh, let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. I think the most interesting thing I heard was the speaker men being diminished because they don't have their leader or their titan, and hopefully he he gets uh, freed soon because we, we need uh, uh, to have everybody back on our side so that we can finally defeat the Skibidi Toilets so that we can get to the real war which will be the speaker men versus the TV men versus the cameramen for world domination. And you know what side I'm on. And with that being said, like, subscribe. Bro, why are you not subscribed? 9%? Bro, 9% is crazy. I'll see you on the next one, bro.